Great Britain, who's having an excellent season, a new personal best for her set in the States, where she's based now in Florida. That was back in April, but she's backed it up with a couple of decent performances since then. A couple of Ukrainians in this, very familiar names. Victoria Katchuk, the 27-year-old, who wasn't too far away from the medals, but of course the medals were taken by the big three in this event at the Olympic Games last year. But at the World Championships two years ago, sorry, three now, Rochelle Clayton of Jamaica took the bronze. She's on the comeback trail after two years out of injury. Geneve Russell, who took the Commonwealth title four years ago, will be looking to defend that in Birmingham this year. She's just one lane outside. The favorite here, of course, Femke Ball, bronze medalist from the Olympic Games. A new world record in Ostrava just over a week ago, over 300 hurdles. She's in fine form, better conditions for her here tonight. Rizhkova will be in lane four. The other Ukrainian, the more experienced Ukrainian, 32, who beat her teammate in Tokyo. And then we've got a couple of Italians in lanes three and four. The very experienced follower, Runzo, in lane three. And then Linda Olivieri picked up a silver at the under-23 championships, European under-23s, three years ago. And then Yasmin Giga from Switzerland right on the inside. I see better conditions for Femke Ball. She ran in front of a home crowd in Hengelo just on Monday earlier on this week. It wasn't a particularly nice evening, a lot of rain, but she still ran sub-54 seconds. And if you think she won here in Rome in 2020 when she was still a developing athlete, ran 53.90, was delighted on that night with that performance. Well, that's almost become a standard run. In fact, you could almost say a slower run for Femke Ball these days. So Ball in lane five, Russell outside her and Clayton, the two Jamaicans, Katchuk of Ukraine, Nielsen, and Rizhkova in lane four as well. Watch out for her. 400 meter hurdles. Seven. A little tardy out of the blocks, Femke, block, Femke Ball on this occasion, but already just about into a stride and easing up alongside Geneve Russell, who hasn't started particularly quickly. Her teammate, Rochelle Clayton, gone much quicker down the back straight, setting the pace for Femke Ball. Rizhkova in lane four, trying to stay with the tall, rangy Dutch athlete and Nielsen right on the outside is just going to have to trust her strike pattern here and then hope she can stay as others gather her up around that top bend but Femke Ball just about in the lead now by a couple of metres a stride or more and it's starting to extend even more this is where she's so good really good on the strike pattern now she wants to hit this one perfectly well one more barrier to go here Femke Ball trying to stride out and then she'll run hard off this last barrier just loses a little bit of momentum Russell coming through for second but it's Femke Ball all the way 53-03 that's an excellent run more progression for Ball She's only run under 53 seconds four times in her career. One of those, of course, in the Olympic final. So that really shows you how quick that was. That is one of her best, quickest performances ever. In fact, uh, well, on her, all, her own all-time top ten, it ranks number five. Super run. Really, really good. When it was, and Femke Ball, and it's worth just reminding ourselves that she only turned to hurdling in 2019. This is still... Relatively speaking, a new event for her, having been a 400 flat runner, but she makes it look so easy. Not the greatest of starts, as you hinted, but just eased herself into the race and got better and better. And then, coming into that final barrier, there's clear daylight ahead of uh, Russell. And then it's just a question of stretching away and using that flat speed off that final barrier. 53, 94 in Hengelo, in very, very different conditions. and. That is another excellent run there in an event. 51-61, Sid McLaughlin and uh, Lena Nielsen. A personal best for her, the British runner, in fourth place. Yeah, good. Uh